My name is Navid Kazem, and I'm a PhD student at Civil and Environmental Engineering Department at Carnegie Mellon University. So conventional electronics and robotics rely on rigid materials like metals, carbons, and ceramic. However, in order to have a device that can have physical human interaction or be safe around people, we really need to start moving away from those rigid materials and adopt some softer materials. Rubbers and elastomers are a popular choice for this adaptation. However, these elastomers are insulators. They do a horrible job in conducting heat or electricity. Currently, the way in order to increase the conductivity of these rubbers is by embedding rigid metals, powders, metal powders, carbons, or ceramics. However, the problem and downside of this approach is that these rigid inclusions make these rubbers more stiff and more brittle. However, in my thesis, we're taking a different approach. We are using a specific type of metal alloys that is liquid at room temperatures. These liquid metals are non-toxic, safe for contact with human skin, and have viscosity similar to water. Also, because they are conductive, they can be used to tailor electrical and thermal properties of these rubbers. So in my thesis, we made this thermally conductive rubber, which we call it Thubber. This Thubber has mechanical properties similar to rubbers, this soft and stretchable rubbers, while having heat conductive properties that is approaching some metals like the stainless steel. As the next stop, Professor Majidi and I are working on a startup spin-off in order to commercialize Thubber for use in electronic industry and automotive industry. So this material can have a lot of applications as a thermal interface material for dissipating heat from a heat generating device to a heat sink, as well as it can have application in automotive industry where you're required to be able to dissipate heat in a soft and more comfortable, with a soft material that can be more comfortable, for example, for a car seat.